Oh my days. Black 450 has had something done. That is insane. That's going to be so sick. Oh my god, bro, I can't believe we found this! No way! Oh my god! That's a prison! That's a prison! Yo, what is going on guys? My name is Jack Tilkstone. So, welcome to the third Fright Nights construction update. Me and Kieran once again. Three weeks on from the first one, or four? Four. Four weeks on from the first one, two weeks from the last one. So yeah, we're back again today to film another update. We're going to be looking at all the mazes. Now that we have a lineup, we know we've got two Walking Dead mazes. We know where they're going. Oh, did you see the billboard on the way in? Yeah, yeah, yeah I was pointing to it. Yeah. But yeah, now that we've got information, hopefully we'll be able to talk about the construction updates a bit more. So yeah, let's head into the park now. Where are we going to head first? Big top again? Yeah, do the same route as usual. So we're heading to the park now. Yeah, let's go. I can't believe we've done this. So outside the, around the back of the big top, we've got the props, we've got some burgers and cogs over there. That burger, by the way, is from I'm a Celebrity. Do you know that? Yeah. So yeah, a lot of the props in there are from ITV on um, a Celebrity. But yeah, mate, the construction is looking good. We've got the big cloud. What are they calling Carlos or something? I think it's Carlos. What the heck? Oh, what's this? That's that same mark that's on the Blair Witch tent. But why is there a 2018? And why does it say Legacy like in blood? Like, it looks like it's supposed to be like blood. It's all Legacy, isn't it? Like that is very interesting. And this is a box of stuff. Right now, I'll kind of call it in September 2017. The Walking Dead's a permanent maze next year. Ooh, that's the only link I can make. There was that has been that's put there on purpose. Yeah. So that through there is, of course, the Strove Room in the big top. It's Hansen. very open today, Hansen. isn't it? Yeah, like every door is open. Are you saying the layout in there is the same? Yeah. It's hard yeah. to tell. Back oh my god. Exciting oh, stuff. Well. Exciting stuff. So we are now heading down to Swarm Island to see if we can see anything else regarding those shipping containers and what will probably be the Sanctum Maze. But Kieran's just been saying to me his little prediction yeah, about what that sign meant over at the Big Top. So there's that sign that's been on the Blair Witch for like a year now and has the Blair Witch returned this year? It has not. So could this mean this is the Big Top Could that be year? the little symbol that means a major not coming back? And, and it legacy, said legacy. Like, you know, the legacy of the Big Top's leaving. Right? So does that mean this will be Big Top's last year? But at the same time, this could just be like a total troll. Like they, they know we made videos, so... It could just be them like mugging us off. We'll see you next year. Could it be Big Tops last year? I don't know. I feel like if it is Big Tops last year, they'll say something like, you know, like they won't just let it go. Oh, yeah, yeah, I know. Oh, God, on YouTube. Theme Park Worldwide. So, as you can see from that little photo over at the Sanctum Maze. This is going to be the Sanctum guys by the swarm, unlike what other people are saying. Bullshit. The fire engine is now in the maze, construction work is going on. What are you saying about it? Like, Pretty cool. I mean, we did call it like four weeks ago that it was going there, but we did without with it. But yeah, it's over there now. But it doesn't look like they've actually got any like, maze, like, I don't know how to explain it. No, at the moment it looks more like a scare zone than a maze. Right, it's still a big open space with just fire engine in the middle. Because it just looks like you're going to be, it doesn't look, like, I consider a maze to be like tight corridors, like, but this looks like more of a scare zone, it's quite open at but the then, moment. It must go inside. I think it so will. Why would they use it? That is so long to get this container yeah. over there, but it's just not. Um, so yeah, this is obviously going to be the gate that you go through to join that queue. We think the Sangdom queue is going to be the swarm extension line, just there. Because it makes sense, doesn't it? But yeah, we're going to head over to containment now to see if anything's changed with that, so let's go. They're testing the audio. The tent 
where the props were is now a lot more empty, which means they're putting stuff back in there. I think that's what they must have done in there when there was uh, they put everything out, now, gave it like a fresh stick of paint, maybe some art, new stuff, and then they took it all back in. Living, the Walking Dead living nightmare. Oh my <laughs> god, that's no a prison. Way, a that's a prison. Oh my god, no way. Oh, the viewers put it back. No. Right, so we just went and had a look. The living nightmare maze. We weren't even expecting anything today. We were obviously because in the last construction update they completely blocked off um, the view from it. So but you today, know what that was? Us, they're building those things. Yeah. And the light, there was no lights in there last time we went. That's why it was so dark. But today we went in and you can literally just see three cell block doors. They open as well. Like you, they can open and close. Like one's open. So I don't know why they'd make them to open them. <laughs> So that is going to be the prison scene from The Walking Dead. I showed a photo of it in like my previous video, Fright Night's video. Put the picture up here now. Right there, right there. And yeah, it looks like that's going to be the scene. Like also, not actually have two floors, but technically it does. Like you can't go up to the second floor and then it will be like yeah. it will take up two stories, yeah. two stories. And then just the other side of that, there's like a brick wall. I've got a picture of it. And like we think you're gonna either go into the prison that way or come out of the prison. That sort of thing. That's gonna be like the exterior of the prison with like a little facade. So we're thinking that leads to the old exit. So you might go in the old exit, into yeah. the courtyard, get a little tour. And then go in. And then you'll go into the prison where you'll see the cell blocks. And then eventually I think that Negan's gonna chase you out with like the bloody baseball that's, bat. That's all we think the ending is gonna be. And also Jack said that he thinks the maze is gonna start as soon as you go in. I think the old cabin maze used to go down that corridor to start with, but it was a queue line and it was always a bit pointless. And it always got like really busy. I think this time that will be that part of the maze. And that will be active. <laughs> So what's that, Kieran? Well, watch the last video, see what we said was going there. Of course, we, we announced that we thought the four little concrete pillars outside of this building would be a new theming element for the Walking Dead maze. And it seems to have come true. Well, yeah, there's something big there. We're gonna go have another look at it from a different angle. A good angle, like a really, really good angle. It will be able to see it really good. But it does look like a theming element. It looks like a big watchtower where they're gonna put a the Walking Dead sign. I mean, just calling it now. Of course, the platform tunnel is now back. Oh, it's so nice to see that they've changed it this year. They've left a bit, little bit, of, where is it? They left a little area there for the conductor at the end. It is good that they are changing it, but you know, they didn't have that tunnel after that. So yeah, they've confirmed that there are new scenes coming to platform this year, so we'll have to see what they are. I don't think it'll be the same as it was before, but I think that they know that was bad. Like, it never worked, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. I think they'll just change the ending. Nothing going on here by the look of it. Monk's Walk today will actually be cool. Like, that's we what, will be doing that's, Monk's, that's what Monk's, sign, guys. Guys. Monk's Walk. I reckon we'll get there today. You know? Yeah, you think we'll get something I good? Think the Blair Witch Shed might even be gone. I'm excited for Monk's Walk today, it should be good. Should we on the Inferno exit as well? Yeah. There's 27, question zero question mark. And of course Blair Witch isn't returning, so could that little symbol mean amazing returning? So we are now walking down Monk's Walk once again. We left the park. Here though is where the fire engine used to be. If you've been watching our other construction updates you will have seen there's been a fire engine there. But um, as we saw today and earlier in the video, that fire engine has now been moved over to the Sanctum Maze over by the Swarm. Which I called four weeks ago. Yeah, we did, we did, we did call this. We said it would happen. But yeah, it's going to be sick in that maze because it fits in with the Walking Dead, like apocalyptic theme. So yeah, well done to Fort. Nice bit of theming in that maze. So yeah, we're just going to carry on down Monk's Walk, see if we, if anything else has changed.
There are still speakers. And also, can we just address the fact that Fort posted a picture like it's a teaser with the Blair Witch thing in it? Like, what, yeah. What was that about? I said this in my um. I said this in my um. The Walking Dead coming to Fright Nights video. I said they posted a picture with the Blair Witch or an American Horror Story um, stick thing. And now neither Blair or American Horror Story is coming. So the thing that annoys me as well about that is we're never going to find out what that was. No, about. like they're not just going to. Were they planning on doing something? Obviously, the I'm a Celebrities area area is over there. So I'm pretty sure that's what they're just using as parking for like all the trucks and stuff. Yeah, a lot of demon trucks there. So finally, guys, platform 15 has had some no, no, kind. It's like uploads. It's like uploads. Oh my <laughs> days! Platform 15 has had something done. That is insane. This That's is gonna crazy. be so sick. After four weeks of nothing happening down here, something has happened. Yes. Oh, let's show you. Let's show you. Chuck it over. Chuck it over. Oh my god. Oh. No way. Oh. <laughs> so, four weeks of progress, and they've added about six gas canisters. <laughs> Hey! <laughs> but no guys, those gas canisters will be used for the fire effect, I'm guessing, like, yeah, because when you walk in, obviously, big fireball, other than that, nothing's changed. So we are just leaving Monk's Walk now, guys, but look, here it is. Here is another X Fan Club sticker. So yeah, we haven't seen as many today as we did last time, but I do have something to talk. About. There are still some on park. So if you remember, in my last construction update, we like found all these stickers, and the Instagram page had just launched, I think. Yeah, like a week ago today. Well, because me and Kieran used to like say we were in an X Fan Club, like back in the day, we've hit these guys up with a few messages. They replied. We had a little conversation, sending DMs back and forwards. And they've basically offered us to like become members of the X Fan Club. But yeah, we're not running it in any way. They just basically said we can we can like promote it, promote sort of. it on like, here. We're not like directly associated with it. Like so, like they so they've like, made it. They're like make it. They're running the Instagram page. We don't have page. any control over what they post, so no, they no, might no. like go corrupt or something. But <laughs> imagine. But, but like we. We don't no, have control over anything on the page. They're gonna send us like information about the page, like, information. They're gonna, um, like if they need any help, like say designing something. And like, if they ever like bring help. anything out in the future, they'll send it to us so we can like test it. And like things like discount codes and stuff, because as you noticed, I don't know if you've been on their like Instagram, they've got like a, a website which looks like it's gonna sell something. They've told us they are planning on like really pushing that website soon, so. So they said that they'd link us up with, you know, so codes to give we'll you We'll be able to give you guys discount codes if they ever do like go ahead with the website. Maybe even like giveaways and stuff. Like it was just like basically, they wanted like, well obviously we're very passionate about X. We love X. And, and we were, we were like, channel that like, you know, like it's good for that. It's sick that we've been able to like join up with them. So yeah, we're gonna be giving you guys all the latest X Fan Club news. And hopefully, we get sent some cool things to show you guys. Yeah. But they do like monitor, or, like say this video, they probably will look in the comments. So if there's anything you want to see on their thing, just sort of like comment it down below. Like anything yeah. you want them to say or do or post. I mean, they probably might read the comments. Or if we see something that we think like, we'll just forward it to them. And yeah. And they'll sort it out. So yeah, if you're, if you're not following the X Fan Club yet, Instagram, link below, go give it a follow. So I'm very sorry guys, but I did forget to finish this vlog at the park. My car pretty much broke down, so I, uh, my mind was on that rather than finishing the vlog. But I hope you enjoyed this video nonetheless. Originally me and Kieran said this would be the last Fright Nights construction update. We were going to do three in a row and then we'd call it quits. However, after seeing the response that you guys have been giving these videos, you really seem to enjoy them. I really enjoy making them. So does Kieran. So the two of us are saying, if you guys want it, we'll be down to do one more before Fright Night. So if you want one more construction update before Fright Nights begins, then let us know down in the comments below. And yeah, we'd be down to make it. 
But otherwise guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a thumbs up. As I said, leave a comment for another construction update. And otherwise, I hope you enjoyed this video guys. My name is Jack Silkson. Goodbye.